Hi, it's Mike and welcome to this video. Today we're going to be talking about working with wiki files and wiki images. Uh, please note that the students by default aren't allowed to upload files. So uh, if you want the students to upload files to their wiki, then at subcategory level, you need to adjust the uh, settings and permissions for students. Anyway, so let, let's have a look at this uh, demonstration wiki page that I've created and this previously features in another video that I've created uh, about wikis, so have a look at that as well. What I'm going to do, I'm going to click edit here and create another link to a brand new wiki page and in this instance I've called the new wiki page files and images and note the double square brackets to create that new page. Uh, oh by the way, once you've created a page you can't rename it so uh, just have a care what you're naming your pages. So I've called this one files and images and I will click save the big blue button at the bottom. And on this uh, uh, home page if you like of our wiki what you can see is a red link saying files and images. It's red because that indicates that we uh, haven't created that files and images uh, wiki page yet. So how do I do that? So I'm going to click edit um, and in the editing, uh, <coughs> editing text editor you can see all the buttons just like maybe on Microsoft Word and I've created, I always, uh, first thing I do is create a home page link to take me back to the wiki home page and then I've added some text saying here we'll look at um, adding images and files within the wiki. So how do we do that? Um, along the tabs you'll be able to see on the sort of uh, far right hand corner uh, for far right hand side of the tabs is uh, a tab called files I'll click that and then um, you'll see on the right hand top right hand image you see an empty file section with a button saying edit wiki files so I will click that and the next image uh, bottom right hand corner of this slide shows you what you see next so <clears throat> first of all, there's a, here there's a blank list of uh, stuff because we haven't added any, added any files yet so We'll click on the effects, uh, the attach icon uh, that's highlighted in red, and the next uh, screen you'll see is uh, an area where you can drag and drop files onto. But don't forget, uh, at some stage you need to hit save. Um, underneath the file manager, there'll be a section saying unused files. Um, this goes away if the files have been used within the wiki, uh, but at the moment all I've done is dragged and dropped um, the demonstration PDF into the system. Okay, so let's uh, assume we want to use uh, an image on our, on our page. So click the little sun and mountain icon that you can see highlighted in, uh, in a red box. And the next... Um, box that comes up is called image properties click on the browse repositories and find your image that you want to upload and upload it as usual don't forget you want to save images uh, save the image button too once the image is in the area that uh, your files are in you can then click on the image itself this one called demonstration and then select this file if that's the one you want. That opens up yet another box and you can see the URL at the top. Uh, you can give it a small description if you want. I'll just call it watercolor painting. I hope you like it. I did it some, some years ago. Um, and then you can adjust the uh, image size that you want on your page. I don't like uh, huge images, I always go for about 500 pixels on the longest side. And then click um, save image at, at the bottom. And you can see here, um, in our editing feature of our new wiki page called Files and Images, um, the image size looks good. Uh, just scroll down to the bottom and hit save. And on the right hand side you'll see what the wiki page looks like, so that's nice. Um, if you're having a struggle with the size of the um, text editor, um, what you can do is uh, click on the sort of um, the 
like the enter button if you like um, highlighted in red here on the top left um, and at the end of all the uh, buttons you see see one with uh, like a, uh, a cross or arrows pointing always in a cross and that opens up the text edit editor in the full screen mode Okay, so um, I demonstrated that we added a PDF earlier on. And if you look underneath the uh, uh, watercolour painting, I've added a sentence and I've highlighted link to PDF. What, with that highlighted, then I go to the buttons at the top and click on the, uh, the link icon. Another um, uh, pop-up will, will appear and you click browser repositories that will take you to the file section so you click on the pdf that you want to be linked and then click select file and then uh, scroll down click save and here on our wiki page that we've created it's the one called files and images we've got the link to the home page we've got a little sentence we've got the image and now underneath that i've got another sentence with link to pdf a note if a wiki user clicks on that that uh, pdf will download to uh, their browser for them so really that's it my name is mike thanks for listening i hope you enjoyed it uh, please subscribe to this channel if you wish uh, hit like if you wish i'm at a little gray hair.com on twitter sorry a little gray hair on twitter and uh, little gray hair.com on the web so uh, this is mike signing out thanks